just like any other romantic comedy, but with two guys. The media's moved on to just showing a normal gay relationship. We're at that chapter where we don't have to constantly make it about being gay. We are both uh, on a double date with the two main characters, and um, it doesn't go so well <laughs> for them. My gay romantic comedies, I don't think, are any different than a mainstream movie. What would I rent on Netflix on a Friday night if I was sitting on the couch with my partner? What would be the perfect movie that I would rent? Nowhere in the movie does anyone ever have the line of, oh, you're gay, How, what is that like? We're in this world where that's already like, side thought, whatever, we're in a relationship. I think the love story that takes place and the, to find love and like, you know, why can't I find love or who can I love or why doesn't he love me or she love me? I, it's just a journey for these characters. It's just a really sweet movie with a great storyline. What's the secret to romance or what's the secret to good comedy? In film or in, in life? Yeah, <laughs> I would say the secret to both is pacing. Favorite movie ever is White Man Can't Jump. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I love that. Why, that. why is that? Why do you like that? It's so good. Go back and watch it. Like, it's so good. The acting so sharp. It's such a fun story. I mean, it's not even that great a story. It's just a great. I love White Man Can't Jump. Sponsorship opportunities are available throughout the year. Donate today or become a board member. Help bring the best in LGBT cinema to San Diego. Financial support for Film Out San Diego is provided in part by the City of San Diego Commission for Arts and Culture.